bonus news, everybody. Guys, today we have one of the more craziest, I guess you could say, episodes of bonus news today. We got something very wild in terms of news and something that I never thought that I would even be saying myself because I didn't think it would ever exist, but lo and behold, it actually exists. Today, guys, we're going to be talking about the newest leak slash data mine to come to fruition, and that is going to be the Storm King Hammer in a Fortnite Save the World. A very interesting thing to say, of course. So, yeah, let's just go ahead and jump into this. So this story, of course, stems from Twitter, just like all great things. By the way, speaking of great things, my Twitter account is right here. If you guys want to go follow it, it'll be somewhere down in the description. We're almost at 4,000 followers. I would greatly appreciate it. I'm very active over here on Twitter. But yeah, so this story stems from Twitter and it actually came from me, you know, going about my timeline. And of course, I follow Storm Shield 1. Well, Storm Shield 1 tweeted out a very interesting tweet which was this one down here it said here have an 8.5 patches page so I was like okay let's check out the patches page because normally we do have a lot of leaks that will come from these pages well I clicked on it and I got taken this screen right here uh, and whenever they do these patches pages they basically showcase all the data mined and all the leaked information that gets added in these patches so of course we have the BR stuff we got the glider the pickaxe blah 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 backpacks weapons playlists dances emojis okay then we get to the says um and then we get to the save the world stuff so then we have cottontail eagle eye right here probably one of the cutest characters in the game i'm just gonna say it i'm gonna say it i'm a taken man but she's kawaii so you know we have cottontail eagle eye of course then we have the save the world weapons we have the duet which is the new steampunk drum gun weapon assault rifle steampunk high damage yada 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 okay we've already talked about that but what is the new thing here you go down here we have the save the world card packs and this of course is because of the new difficulty increase so more sunbeam more bright core gold blah 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 all that crap well then we have a little section down here that says save the world alteration and that is it in terms of the save the world stuff so you see a aid underscore g underscore on kill underscore charge storm king ham yeah so storm king ham is confirmed but if you were to just highlight this a little bit you can actually see that says hammer so we're not we're not talking about a delicious meat snack we're actually talking about a hammer not storm king ham which I don't even want to get into the topic of that, but it says Storm King Hammer if you were to highlight it. Of course, if you were to click this little icon right here, you'll get taken to this page right here. Of course, the name isn't here. We have no image whatsoever, but as far as the description goes, it says for each enemy eliminated with this weapon, Meteor Slam summons an additional meteor and it stacks up to seven times. This patch was, it, it was added in the patch 8.50 meteor slam so of course it leads you to believe that warframe is going to be the next game that you download okay i don't know <laughs> there's so many ads popping up okay i'm not anyways i'm gonna go back here well okay so we got the you know on kill charge the storm king hammer so it's looking like this is going to be either a schematic or it's going to be a weapon that we can pick up in the middle of a battle but what i'm thinking is that this is going to be something that is going to appear sometime during season nine and there was a a, a long time way back when where they basically announced that the storm king was going to be coming to other zones outside of canny valley for those of you guys that do not know what the storm king uh, is by this time the storm king is the end boss at canny valley and they did talk about him being in potential other zones and they heavily hinted at him being entwined so this whole charging the storm king hammer this whole thing can be uh, either a limited time item that we use during a boss fight maybe like a raid boss mechanic or this could be a reward for defeating the Storm King and you're able to get an exclusive weapon. Now that is what I like to hear. Whether it is a raid boss mechanic or it is a uh, exclusive piece of loot for actually doing something in the game, it's very interesting to even think about. For each enemy eliminated with this weapon, the Meteor Slam summons an additional Meteor that stacks up to seven times. So all we can do is speculate. This, of course, is data mine information. It is, of course, you know, leaked information. We don't exactly know much about it, but all we do know is that it is listed right here as on kill, charge the Storm King hammer. So it is either going to be a mechanic type weapon that you use during a boss fight, or it could be something that is an exclusive item from defeating the Storm King in something like Twine Peaks. But I don't know, guys. I wanted to get this news out to you guys because 
I saw this on Twitter, I thought it was very interesting, and this definitely takes precedent over me making a review on an Outlander that craps out eggs whenever she teleports. So I figured that I'd make a video on this instead. I do want to make a video talking about the Marvel stuff that's been going on recently and why Save the World is not seeing any Marvel content. Of course, as we've seen, the Battle Royale game mode has gotten a Black Widow skin, which has left me very puzzled as to why Save the World has not gotten any Marvel content. Hopefully, I will be having a commentary on that tomorrow but that of course is going to have to wait until tomorrow so guys i hope you guys did enjoy this video let me know what you guys think in the comments down below regarding these leaks and these data mines i hope you guys did enjoy please subscribe if you are new around here i make videos like this every single day like the video if you did like it and all of that great stuff and guys thank you for watching i'll see you guys next time